folks, we're back inside the chicken house today. Again, I'm Tom Tabler. I have with me today Jonathan Moon. Jonathan is our research coordinator, our farm manager for this operation. He tries to keep both sides of our road going, both the commercial side and the research side of the farm. We're inside the chicken house today. We've got little chickens, so we're going to talk a little bit today about baby chicks. All right, well, in a commercial house, uh, the work starts actually before the chicks show up. Uh, one of the most important things, you want to get your house cleaned up, ready for the next flock, wash fans, whatnot. <clears throat> whenever, uh, whenever you're setting your house up, which these birds are a little bit older, they're getting close to about 14 days old right now, so the house looks a little bit different than it would on day one. Uh, when we're placing baby chicks, uh, before the birds show up, one thing we like to do, we, we keep a good routine of uh, cleaning our drinkers out. We run stuff periodically through the flock and then between flocks we will flush and sanitize our lines. Uh, the day baby birds show up we flush again. When we're setting up we, we will have feed trays down the lines. We'll flood those feed trays. We'll also have uh, supplemental feeders, jumbo lids down the lines. We like to make sure we've got plenty of feed uh, available at all times. Uh, the light, we want to make sure we've got the brightest light possible. We typically will run between five and six foot candles. That gets that bird up and moving. We'll run 24 hours of light for the first week. Uh, brighter the light, the quicker they get to feed, the quicker they get to water, the quicker they get to feed and water, the better that chick does. Uh, starting 24 hours before the birds show up, we like to make sure we get a good preheat. Uh, typically that's 90, 92 degrees, and it's more than just the temperature of the air. We're worried about the temperature of the litter. That's where that bird's gonna be sitting. So we wanna get a good temperature, a good preheat on the house, get a good depth to that preheat. Basically, between your brooders, you want to be able to scratch back a little litter and get a good 90, 92 degree litter temp a couple of inches down in that litter. Uh, a lot of the times we will use an ammonia control, uh, whether it be uh, class A7, PLT, something to kind of help uh, control that ammonia. Uh, so that kind of gives you a pretty good idea, folks, at least how we start baby chicks what goes on. And that's pretty much across the board in the commercial industry. It doesn't make any difference who someone grows chickens for. The preheating program Jonathan talked about, getting that house ready before the birds get there is critical to having a good flock of chickens. So we'll sign off and talk to you next time. We appreciate you listening in.